All right, people. Welcome back. More Dev Pro Dual commentary. So we are joined by Mal. So people. And uh, we have Evo Weslo here playing the front versus Gigglet playing. We're not sure yet. And um, I thought that shit was gonna hit the fan. He put that into the void, and I was like, wow, he's gonna like pitch his entire hand. But now he he, uh, he busts out that Decatron, and of course played that powerful, powerful uh, Monster Gate. You know, Monster Gate at one, Reasoning at one. It's all good, right? Dude, I'm good. He nailed a nice chunk of him, nice chunk of him. They even got that uh, mill with Ryzen as well. So Infernoids, they definitely fell off. You know, Reasoning went down to one, and after that, we haven't even seen the deck at all. This man plays where for Art Thou? <laughs> well, Art Thou, or whatever. This <laughs> Yeah, I mean, you, you gotta... If you have a Decatron, you can get a Decatron, right? Oh, yeah. Alright, so... Summon Deviati, because why not? Was that negate? I believe negate. it negates monster effects. Oh, okay. Yeah, because it, it vanishes, right? Yeah, because I believe it heavy storms the field. Yeah, heavy storms is all spells and trap except for void cards, and uh, it negates monster effects. Oh, okay. Because Death Pro doesn't let me scroll down, despite the fact that it says I can scroll down. Yep. So that into void didn't seem to fuck him. He just kind of yeah. did the upstart goblin. Oh, heretics. We're going to see some Ultimaya shenanigans. The OG the Ultimaya should, play. The man should definitely have more than his fucking extra deck. <laughs> That's all you need. You need Ultimaya and then all the cards that summon Ultimaya. That's it. And then, like, a uh, okay. a tome. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, crap. So, never got can negate you. You have to make your effect by tripping that right. But, damn, this deck kind of just fell off. So, it fucking sucks. I, I, I was fine with it. I think that I think they were kind of wow. You're just gonna summon that's it. And that's it. Wow. All right. Well, I'm not sure how long this duel will be. Oh my god. Did he just mill all in front? GG. He oh, milled no. into the void, a scolding, a solemn scolding in there. Actually, yeah. Scolding. Yeah. He doesn't have too much set card, so he's gonna go ahead and pay a nice chunk of his life points to make sure he stops everything. 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 Uh. I feel like shit. <laughs> I understand the film. Oh my god, he has another ring. Yep. Didn't he just search for it? Oh yeah, you're right. True, yeah. true. <laughs> oh, time to get it in. Look at all the negates. Like, really? That's all you do is just summon tap to end your turn? Like, that's disappointing. I haven't seen like, much of any of these two decks. It's just like, yeah, Fortnite's were decent until Reasoning got hit down to one and... Wow, Ooh. or you could catch this honest boy. Yeah, but he can negate, negate. that. Yeah. <laughs> it doesn't say on the field, it just says monster effect for getting negated, boy. And take that 800. I thought he was like, I have another Amis. <laughs> I have another negate, so like. I don't believe Deviati is once per turn. No, I don't think she's once per turn. Yeah. And Erotics, I mean, they just kind of fell off too. They got their seal to three. And there's just other decks that you can make my better with. Like, I've seen a couple of Herald decks using Heretics, of course, as tribute for your Herald, so you can bust out your Labradite and go into some Ultimate plays, but outside of that, not really. Hmm. I mean, he still has resources. Oh, shit. I'm say, am I crazy? In that case, this man actually about to do what I was just talking about, actually tributing his Heretic Monsters to Ritual Summons, and then getting their effects? Wait, hold on, for real? Possibly. Man. Or he's just gonna get negated by Deviati. Like, Deviati's just locking this duel down. Deviati oh, yeah, it, does, it did banish. Yeah, okay. It must be on the field when it banished. Yeah. Okay. Alright. Alright. Cool. More fodder. Wow. Once again, the plays are just so anticlimactic. The special summon that, and then just end. Nothing to tribute, nothing to do anything with. Like, I'm not even sure how many heroics you're even running. I don't even know what deck you're running on. I'm assuming you're running something ritual based, maybe like Cyber Angel or something thrown in with the heroics, just a tribute. This man has 12 left in his deck. Holy shit. Yep, 12 left in his deck, but as long as he can end this duel, he's just. He's not pushing through. He needs something else, but freaking. Both of his Ragnars are gone. There was, that was the addition of damage. He can't summon any other Infernoids with Deviati on the field, so. Nope. Unless she runs on Lumina, which can get him back. Mm-hmm. We haven't seen Lumina all duel, so I'm not mm -hmm. even sure if he runs it. Top decks Lumina, let's go. Say, can he last 
enough turns to deck this man out. I, I kind of want to look at the graveyard, Death Pro. Um, hey, uh, oh, the oh, oh. Yep. Ah, uh, Norden. So fair. Such it a, is. Such an enabler. It's so fair. Like, shit like Norden and Soul Charge and all that shit. That's fair. That's fair. Of course. Ah, uh, you can yell at some grade A cancer. It's the best. I, I gotta go fucking get some chemo every time I see this game. <laughs> I, I don't see a problem. I, I thought since we play Yu-Gi-Oh, we're supposed to be used to cancer. Ugh. I'm not dying of cancer. I'm dying of this cold. <laughs> oh my god. So, I guess uh, maybe a gate play, maybe a rank four play. You should there... be able to start pushing through. Yeah, oh, yeah. oh, it's time to <laughs> get back to shit. Of course, you might as well throw in fucking Omega. Omega should probably be limited. Oh yeah, definitely. <laughs> Omega's ridiculous. Uh -huh. The Dark Sleeper Yank is fucking stupid. I'll set a chair. And Gigolus, I just don't think he opened up too hot. Like, if it wasn't for the Deviati negating him, I think he might have been able to pull some pretty strong plays. Looks like he might be playing, like, Cyber Angels with a little bit of Heronic Stone in for Tribute Fodder. But why do you have seven in your <laughs> extra deck? Come on now. Yeah. Good team. It's not that hard. I would have. Like, ex I would have at least accepted some bullshit that you can't summon, yeah? Cyber Angels. Yep, yep, Cyber Angels. And this is actually legitimately Cyber Angels. Wow, so you managed to pick something out of his hand before you wanted to put your Infernoids back during the standby, your opponent's standby phase? Whatever. Your place, this, man. <laughs> this man is that, is not that, or, <laughs> oh, that's me, never mind. Oof. The Gigalus over here is just struggling. Okay, set some cards. Trying to get everything out of your hand so maybe you can't pick something out again. I love Gigalith, that's like one of my favorite Pokemon. <laughs> oh yeah, have you seen did you see that trailer though? Mm-hmm. Oh man. Expansion though. Seriously. <laughs> like, do you even lift, bro? <laughs> Jesus. Like that's why you probably call him expansion since you know if he's like based off that other guy with that um type no, he he expanded. That extra buff. Oof. Wow, and that's game. Why? The set cards were bluffs. I thought maybe he had set like a drowning mirror force or something. But nope. Oh, so, that was pretty fucking boring. Seriously, Deviati just locked it down. But hey, they're stunning you, Gal. Even with Infernoids. All right, we'll get another duel. I mean, we'll, we'll come back for game two. <laughs> right. We're back. Man, you beat his ass again. All right. So that was some quick sightings. He's just hopping right back into it. Once again, no, I'm upside down. So, Gigalith, if you're playing like Cyber Angels or something with Harrow, can you like make an unbreakable board? I've seen One that. I, I faced that in the freaking regionals. Man went fucking first turn. Uh, Harold went stick chair combo into the freaking Ouroboros to pick the card out of my hand and went Insta Fusion to summon uh, Norden to summon uh, the Fairy Cheer Girl and, and draw a card. So Because <laughs> because why not draw even more? God damn. Nope. The more he draws, the more fairy he has her in the game. Of course, Harold's not once for turn. Harold can negate as much as he wants. Yeah, mm -hmm. I, I would say the deck is good, but I wouldn't say it's too good. Cause my big oh yeah, there's Harold. My big gripe with it is uh, you get hit with cut with counter traps. You know? Oh yeah, I've seen I've seen that time and time again where they're like, hey Harold, haha, the gate. I'm just like strike, <laughs> strike that. Oh, the yeah. With the easy access to Silent Strike within them from the tins, though. I mean, I got me a play set. I don't play this game anymore. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, it, I, I don't want to pay any price for some cardboard. I mean, I'm like, probably going to stick with Cosmos. And, oh, and this combo is so good. I've seen this combo before. So, you tribute the Ben 10 for Harold. The freaking right. Donner Harold will get you back your Ben 10, and then the Ben 10 will search. Mm -hmm. That's so, so good. good. <sighs> yeah, so now the, the shoe is on the other foot. It's just like, let me one up you, let me one up you, let me one up you. <laughs> Did you really get another Monge? Okay. Really? Yes. I thought you were going to go with the stick chair. Yeah, I, I was expecting you to get the, yeah, Scepter to be. All right, so you have a Manju and a Cyber Angel Vincent in your hand, so that's two negates. Yeah, two negates. It's pretty solid. Let's take a about that. I'm just noticed that this deck doesn't play um, Petite Cyber Petite Angel. Oh yeah, because it's more of like it only searches um, 
Cyber Rangers, and you only the only Cyber Ranger you're really playing is Benton. I mean, even with Ritual Sanctuary, I'd probably still run it. It's really. so good, yeah. It's a level two monster that's literally like a Menju, and if I get two spell cards in the graveyard, like what he has now, I can summon back to Petit Angel again and get another search. Like this deck complain like people who obviously play this deck uh, complain about consistency they about, you know, open up and bricking, but they don't play the absolute necessary to make sure that everything goes okay for them. Yeah, okay. And I said, I mean, I beat that guy's ass in game three because he just opened up ass. Like, he went first and then ended oh, up nah, not doing nah, shit. Nah. I mean, it was a hard matchup, and I definitely, definitely think that uh, maybe a little bit of a uh, quarantine should be played this format. Um, oh. <laughs> yep, yep. You allowed him to get that, the jump. Why? I would have negated the instant fusion. There is no reason to allow him to get that. Even if he is not going to do anything with Norton, still an enable to play. Instant fusion is still strong by giving you that additional monster. So there goes Harold. Bye, Harold. There's your fucking work gone. All that work gone. But can he protect it from being oh, destroyed? Oh, shit. Yeah. Forgot. The M of Light. That's like the Sephira and he gets Sephira. But it seems like he's running more Cyber Angels than. You would usually see from the deck. Like the only, it seems like what I've seen from the deck at tops is that they only run Ben Ten, and they don't even run this Cyber Ninja Ritual. So you don't need something Ben Ten. You just tribute Ben Ten for the search. Yep. So you forgot about that. Now what? <laughs> I guess he was like, he, I guess he was like, fuck it, I don't care, because mm -hmm. of course that doesn't activate. You just banish it to attack uh, from destruction. Maybe some stick chair plays, maybe some Anju get the search on. Get him pinch itself and get that search. Like, Ritual Sanctuary is just so strong. Mm-hmm. You can even pitch, like, terraformings and stuff and just show plays like that. You're gonna bust out another hero? That's unnecessary. That really is. Like, you don't need double hero. What is double. What is, what is one. What does two hero do that one hero can't do? <laughs> okay, it can negate, I'm pretty sure it can negate in a chain. I believe so, yeah. Yeah, then it's <laughs> unnecessary. You're doing the most there, Gigalith. The absolute most. Yep, but hey, as long as he wins, he possibly right, take it to game three. Yep, Jimmy, that I that Ben 10, summon perfect Herald again. Uh, perfection. Now he's got two Heralds just sitting there with them big old 28 Buddhists. Then Dawn of Herald and wow, yes, I'm not on it. It's certainly honest because you can. So you ain't getting over none. Yo. Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Wait, you know you that you can fuck boy. You know you can activate honest, right? <laughs> Fucking dumbass, man. Do you oh, forget that took lightning from me? Fuck fuck boy. Wow, that was bad. That was bad. That was Wait, bad, I... and you should feel bad. Oh my god. <laughs> what about why didn't you activate Dawn? Yeah, and you didn't activate Dawn either. And grab it's... your Benton back. Oh my what is happening? Giggle, wow. come on, son. Wow, Giggle, I thought you maybe possibly take this game three. Now you're just getting your booty destroyed. See, this is why I I, I fucking didn't trust your ass. Because you had seven cards in your extra day. <laughs> I can just see that shit be like, no, nigga, I don't Ooh. care. Ooh, my nigga, Evo, look what he sided in. <laughs> yeah. No. Let's go. I think the card's going to be great this format. I'm already side decking three. Like, fuck you, man. For blue eyes Yo. in for this deck, boy. Fuck, fuck Cycle Reader. It's all about the quarantine. God damn. All right. So wait a minute, wait a minute. You have the stick, but yet you search for a second Manju? Manju? Really? What's this? Really, Gigalith? I'm disappointed guy. He could have had one more negate if he actually used the damn, like, ritual spell. Yep. I mean, I'm glad that he has two heralds, because, you know, it's totally necessary to have two heralds on the field right now. It really isn't. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I think this... Depending on what Evo has, this might be game. I mean, he has nothing to do with it. Utopia, like, ah. 
The Brokenness. Oh my god, I hate that card. I hate that card so much. That card destroyed me at the regionals. I want to. I... Fucking Soul Charge, man. And every time you have Soul Charge into Infinity. Soul Charge into Infinity. Yep. yep that's buddy. literally everything you. Wow, that's actually pretty disheartening. Mm hmm. Every time my opponent played Soul Charge, they went into Infinity. Every time. Every time? Every time. Jesus Christ. Ah, there's that quarantine. Yep, yep. So you're just gonna send, like, Harmon Deck. And pop the two I'm heralds. Dick. dick and. Dick. And, <laughs> <Harmon> dick. <laughs> <laughs> and gone. And gone. And that's pretty much game. Like. And gone. Wow. Good job, Gigalith. Wow. Spread your cheeks. If you're going to play control deck, you need to be in better control of this duel. You were literally told you to spread your cheeks. You were literally getting everything instead of getting everything that you came to a threat and dropping double herald that doesn't do shit. Like that could have just been another fairy in your hand for the one herald to negate. Good job, fuck boy. And you can't spend seven light monsters, so up, oh, GG. Shake this man hand. Shake this man hand. Fucking quarantine. Okay, cool story, bro. Fuck this dude now. You, you can't. can't. You can't. Yeah, you can see. Then like GG. Yeah. That's game, man. You can't see with that. First you, sentence. You wish you could have went into Exiton. Is oh, it Exiton light, wish. though? Yeah. Yeah, so you couldn't even go into him anyway. Yep, and that's game. Wow. So, if you would have told me that Infernoids would have beat freaking Harold Dot Deck, I wouldn't have believed you. But, that's what happens when you got fuckboy giggling fucking up over here. <sighs> Alright, we're done. We're done. I apologize for this being shorter, but I need to get the recording done as quick as possible so I can go lay back down, because Daniel is dying of sickness. <laughs> so, I hope that you guys enjoyed. Thank you, Mal, for joining me. No problem. Thanks for watching, thanks for support, and I will see you guys next week with some more Death Protocol commentary. Alright, people. Thanks for watching.